Hey guys, it's me, Procast, here today with next episode of NNA Season 2, Episode 4, which is uh, Hands Across uh, Hands Across Ed and Floss Your Ed, which are references to Hands Across America and Floss Your Teeth. Okay. I don't really know why I keep doing the, the reference thing. Don't really do anything. Yeah, Hands Across America, I feel like I remember. No, I, I don't remember. I don't remember Hands Across America. The only time I know. I heard the saying was um, that uh, Jordan Peele movie, uh, Us. I saw, saw it in, when I watched that. That was a good movie. At least I liked it. I don't remember that much about it, but I, me I remember liking it at least. Maybe I'll go watch it one day. And we'll see. But anyway, uh, Hands Across Ed is a four, four B, I mean four A. Um, yeah, I don't really know what the heck to do with that. That. That's a strange title, I'll be honest. So, yeah. Um, um, maybe we're going to try to travel. I know we tried we tried to scam uh, Kevin and them last time with uh, making a rock girl go around the plane and maybe we'll try something like that as well. No, but that'd be kind of repetitive. So, I don't, I, I, I don't know. Probably whenever I see the, uh, Tile screen, we figured it out, but for right now, I I just can't figure that out. Like I said, last time we had the uh, any mini mighty any mini mighty Ed and Ray said Ed, so go check that out when you want to. Uh, those two, those two are fun, but yeah, back to for a hands across Ed. Uh, yeah, I, I I don't know. I just don't know. Since I don't know much much about the hands across America thing, I can't really say anything. I can't read the description because it's like, well, like a few, few sentences, I guess. But I don't want to. I feel like, I feel like they'll give away everything and nothing at the same time. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna go and I, if I can think of anything when I see the uh, title screen, then we'll do it. But yeah, this is a four A starting right now. But no, oh, let's go. Bit further, you're almost there. No, no more. There we go. Made it. Why can't I hear? Oh. Okay, if I was to make a guess based on uh, that, yeah, I don't, I don't know. Maybe a tel television show or something. I'm sorry, I was adjusting my sound. I couldn't hear that well. What? Um. Hey, tell Rolf his eyes do not lie. No. What? With the guy like a giant magnet going on. Why do you have all that? Curse of the sirens in the hungry tree. Where's yes. the cash? Strange, my electromagnet seems to be adverse to certain metal alloys. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Okay. Yeah, guys, get some quarter. Hey, please, not now. God dang it. It blows up. This siren's mm -hmm. coming upon us. So there's a giant magnet. We must go ah. to the belly box, as it is the only way to please the tree. We must please the tree. <laughs> we killed him. I am Rolf, son of a shepherd. That is. Actually, that's it. I kind of. Look at me. Oh, you okay. gonna do a vodka a act? This is better than what I can do. Touch your toe to your nose. Like this. Ah. Okay, now hop forward. Mm -hmm. Keep going. You gotta love him. Huh? on TV. Yeah. That's what I was gonna say. Damn it, damn it, W. You stole my idea. It could be, could be on T is that what that's what the hands of a customer are gonna be on T we're gonna be on TV and uh make a comedy show like uh the Carol Burnett show or the Red Skeleton show. <laughs> if you know what the hell I just said what shows I mentioned, please let me know. Yes he is. I'll give you Mr. Showbiz. Wow, it's Ed came up technically Ed, they both came the both camera double three and egg came up with the idea. So yeah. Come on, Mr. Big Show. <laughs> Let's rehearse plank. Yeah, I feel like Kevin's already on to them. Kevin with the chills. Here's my audition. <laughs> <laughs> Losers. Pretty oh, geez. After our show, we'll be rolling in jawbreakers. Rolling, Mr. Eddie! Um, I'm I may be dumb or what the other price. But, um, 
Usually you're, well. So far, all your scans are to get money to get jawbreakers or get jawbreakers in general. How does this get you jawbreakers? Well, technically, your scams are. To, that will, I'll give them the, this one thing: they put in the work for every single scam to try to make them make them work. So I'll give them that. They are persistent and hardworking when it comes to scams. Eddie is. The other two are just doing what they. Well, Ed kind of, Ed kind of just gets dragged along because he finds fun. But how does this get you jawbreakers or money for jawbreakers? Because the I've never, I've never done an audition for anything. I don't really think I ever will. It'd be fun to do acting, but not really my thing. I don't think. But um, unless I'm mistaken, I don't think they pay you to come do the acting. Unless what you're trying to do is have them trading drawbreaker to be in the TV and everything, like a bribe. It'd be fun. It's gonna be fun if that that thing is actually working as a camera. So, yeah, I can't figure out how that works. Unless the plan is to somehow make a film, make a film, because potentially that does not work. So make a, make a fake film that people think they're in, and then they're in a showing, we charge money to go, come see it. And then we run away before they, uh, before they realize there's nothing there, and we get job workers that way. If that's the plan, it kind of works. Granted, they know where you live, so they get you to come kick your ass. But uh -uh, I guess we'll find out. <laughs> Look at guys, he's on a roll. He's going straight to Hollywood. Auditioning, Johnny two by four, and Plank. Anytime you're ready, kid. Plank tells jokes. Mm hmm Knock him dead, buddy. <laughs> Darn. His acting skills are very stiff. He's kind of wooden. <laughs> I thought it was pretty good. We don't have all day. Hi, guy. Uh, yeah. To audition. Pl Plank was so good. He didn't even have me a split. Uh, stitches. He had me a splinters. <laughs> knee slapper. <laughs> I actually just slap a knee. Hi, Nas. You have a tuba? This one girl sounds like that that uh, band geeks episode of uh, SpongeBob, where the entire band group exploded the building. She sounds just like that, like entire group of people with how annoying that tube is. So get on her, I guess. Bravo! I, I gotta watch band geeks. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> well, I, I guess. Sign her up. Yeah. Has single-handedly annihilated all that is music. Yeah, uh, yeah true. Hello. I will be performing my country's traditional dance of the hairless otter. Nah. Hairless otter? I'm curious. No budget for subtitles. Ready? Uh, oh, no. Them. Okay, come on, come on. Time is money. Technically, it is. <laughs> nervous? I've got corn stuck in my teeth. Okay. Okay, Jimmy's got some talent, okay? What is that thing called? Mm -hmm. You're a star, baby. Lose the amateur, and you'll be a host. Yeah, yeah, I was gonna say, uh, Jimmy was doing very well. Don't do it, Jimmy. Don't do it. Don't become a jerk. Don't, don't do it. We just, I no. Be a star. Damn it, Jimmy. Our dishes are closed. So the only time, I'm sorry for pausing so much. No time, time we got. Well, I have to pause so I can talk. You know. What? <laughs> I'll get through the sense one day without getting distracted. <laughs> okay, so the only talent we got so far is uh, Naz and Jimmy out of everybody there. But as we saw from last episode, technically Kevin has the most talent from with the bike, bike stuff and unicycle riding, which I find even funnier. But also, I will say Jimmy's thing with the banger. What what is that sound? I would look it up. I don't know what type of instrument. That uh, cause I know I know that sound. I feel like anybody would. So yeah, but uh, Jimmy was good. Naz, they just 
they just got her because they like, well, Eddie got her because he likes, they all like her. But, uh, yeah, she was, she has it too, but that's about it. But, oh, well, guess we're going to find out what happens next. Deja vu. How'd you get sucked into this again? Didn't we, didn't we have a big TV thing with, oh yeah, we had the, uh, hypnotizing thing a long time ago. Take your money. Hi, uh, Double D. Pledges. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's all about raising money for Ed's eyebrow operation. Jeez. Oh, here we go. Find it in your hearts to give and help us yeah. reach our goal. <laughs> so, is it out? Without your pledges, Ed's eyebrow could spread all over his body. Mm -hmm. My stupid body. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. It started. I mean, that is like. Is more? Oh, no. <laughs> okay, oh, poor Ed. Show. It's about time. What? Please give it up for that tuba it, diva. Like a. Naz! Yay! Yeah, well, at least not Bucket. Go, Naz, go! Ah, now you're into it! Bye, Eddie! Oh my god, he's dead. A pledge! Uh huh? And telephone! Eddie, do you keep donations in the fridge? <laughs> Jimmy! Jimmy, you're up! So much you got, Jimmy. Magically bloom from a pot of soy. Mm -hmm. Say the magic words. Bubbly bubbly boo. Huh? Mm. <laughs> oh, he's laying an egg. Actually, he's growing a flat, growing flowers. Sir, just blank, blank. Okay, sir. Okay. I will now show Rolf in. Uh. <laughs> me almost saw him in half. What's going me? He's going well. <laughs> yeah, this is going well. Poor Jimmy. No! How how will we save his eye as eyebrow? And telethon? Well, Are pizza? donations bigger than a bread box? Um. This telethon's countless as heaven. Stupid broom. Yeah. Uh, I'm otter feet. We. we <laughs> I gotta be honest. That was impressive. I at least he didn't break the broom. <laughs> so, uh, what's the what? our money they're throwing? Technically, we could have used Kevin's. We could have used. Why would we work Kevin? No. So, what is the plan? Romeo and Juliet. Who's laughing now? The ma the magnet again? First time. Oh, uh, it's not gonna go well. It Uh, that's not good. Bye. Uh. Double D. Silly me. It appears I put the batteries in backwards. Uh, uh. You sure haven't been on the ball lately, huh, Double D? Yeah, you really haven't. Yeah. The funky, huh, guys? You, you can say they had a trash act. <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> okay, anyway. Okay, uh... Yeah, that was uh, hands across that knocked all hacks. Don't just finally see the first one scam go from start to finish. Yeah, they were they were doing pretty well. If only we had gotten uh, Kevin, we could have got we could have done like the uh, Muppets did, like I mentioned, yo, with Stantler and Wal Walters. Stan What's the two old man's name in uh, Muppets? Where they heckle everybody, especially Fozzie. We we need Kevin. Yeah, well. We don't really need him, but we can use him to make more money. So, cause yeah, that would have worked really well. Naz was, was we should have really made a comedy show. But also that also means that poor, poor Ed will never get his eyebrows fixed or his eyebrow. So poor, poor, poor Ed. And then poor, poor Jimmy, he, he went from uh, stardom to lame him at this all when it spent like a, an afternoon. Because this has been one day, probably. It probably, I couldn't too. Wait, 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 wait. How the, how did Jimmy go from doing, go from doing the uh, music, musical thing with Sarah to doing magic? He should have kept to the, with the first stick. Stick? That's how you say it? Stick? Yeah, if he sticks that, he could have been really good. Also, why do we put double D in front, in the camera? And a year of the, yeah, out of the three of you guys, you are the most likely to be on camera. Maybe maybe we're going to jail in a few years, but you're the most likely. 
So you could have easily done stuff. All, and we're still never going to get poor Ed's eyebrow. What the heck? Why was he in the floor? Why, why is he looking for a donation down there? But, uh... Um, uh... Does Farf have two eyebrows? No, he has a unibrow, too. So, get good for him. Maybe we we'll get Rolf's, uh... Unibrow fix. I think. Oh, fuck. That's the image. <laughs> yeah, that, that's the image to pause on right now. <laughs> We're going, to, we're going to eat Kevin. He, well, he does deserve it, if you will. But, uh... Yeah. That, that was actually a, a fun, fun one, just... I, I wish the camera... I wish I had an actual camera. Technically, you could say they have a cam, cameraman, because we are watching this right now, so they were recording, if you will. Air quotes. But, uh... If only now... Maybe now it's coming good, too, but again... I sure really got that down with, with all the things that come up, come back up in the, well, like my opponents that maybe the tuba will come back up one day. Maybe. Be funny if it does. If it, do, if it does and I forget, please call me out for it. But, um, yeah. Uh, that was Hands Across Ed. I'll go back, I'll, I'll go back to talking about it a little bit. Floss your Ed, though. Uh, I was just trying to say Floss your Ed boy. I had a text message. I guess it has to do with teeth. Uh, get to teeth. Maybe they, maybe they finally get. Um, maybe they finally got a jawbreaker, and they but they had a terrible one, and they had to not not eat it. I really don't. I don't know. But oh well, we're gonna we're gonna find out. So three, two, one, go. What is this? Triton, and uh -huh. welcome to Ed's Sea Adventure. Ready for adventure? No. <laughs> Come on, Johnny. Behold. What'd you guys get on his paint? Lover? I'm Barnacle Ed. For a lousy 25 cents, jump on my back and ride a barnacle. You're... <laughs> Eddie, you messed up. We shouldn't make him pay to get out. Now. That'll be 25 cents. <laughs> All I have is coconuts. Help yourselves. Ooh, coconut. I don't like coconuts. Thanks, King Triton. Me and Blank had a blast. Mm-hmm. <gasps> you you should really Johnny like boy. it. Can I shave them? Yes. Dear Ed, you don't shave coconuts. Oh. You eat them. Oh. Like report cards. Y I guess. <laughs> oh. Are you all right, Ed? No. So you're in pain. It is. Oh, my tooth hurts. Yeah, God. Yeah, God, no. I, I don't even like talking about no. They're beyond, beyond hard. They're, I was going to make a joke, but I refused to say anything. But God, God that, that had to. Uh, Can you break a tooth on count? Oh, oh count. Can you break a tooth? Um, a coke, coke nut. I don't have. I don't. Uh. Mhm. Mm I like how the. Okay. How do I? How can I break my tooth fast? What the fuck? Oh, okay, okay. Best part, loose deal. I was like. Why are you trying to break a t uh, your tooth on purpose? I've actually broken my tooth a few times, actually. One time at school and one time I was over here. Ironically enough, I guess I could answer the question if you could break your tooth on a coconut. Because the time I broke my tooth, I broke it on a bacon from a bacon eater. St yeah, my doctor said that. Yeah, that's, that's still my weirdest time breaking a tooth. Yeah. It was extremely weird. I broke it and I, hit, I bit it. And a piece of bacon just right for a broken tooth that had already had a, a a feeling and everything from it. So, mm -mm. but but yeah, a coconut definitely hurts. You just want to wear this beard, don't you? No. I suggest an examination of this culprit. Cousin. Yeah. You gonna take the claws off though? Uh, I'm gonna say it's every single tooth. Oh yeah! Oh. Hey, big box for this too. Don't touch it. 
That hurts. Let go of the tooth. Oh. This one. Yes, you have. You, you should really go go to the doctor about that. Where'd the tooth go? Get it roll under here. It's still um. It's still in your mouth. Yeah. Barely. Come on, baby. Come on. God, I. Oh, that was brilliant, Eddie. I bet you were up all night thinking of that plan. The itinerary of dental growth is carved in stone. Hey, Double D. Yeah, no. Is that Nan Hill? Yes. Why, yes, it is. A fine Oh, we can't get up to him. Huh. Nimble, quick. Why did Kenny leave? Anyway. Okay, let's go. Um. Uh, Hang on. Say whiplash. Whiplash. Hi, Mom. Ed, you need to protect that tooth. Why? I was just playing with Eddie. Oh. Eddie, Poor. you dropped her. Plum. Poor, this poor Eddie. This is tougher than I thought. I feel like that tooth's gonna be like that fly. So time I try to try to catch, it's just gonna. I bet you by the time we get it out, the someone was stolen it and got the money. Those those assholes. Yeah, I um I don't really know what the problem is. I I kind of remember back back when I was a kid that whenever I had baby tooth, I I was impatient, okay? So I well I'm impatient now. But I was I think I'm about I'm, about, I'm actually less impatient. I'm more patient now than I was back then. Because I'm thinking, if I'm correct, because I'm times times like, like uh, if I had loose tooth or whatever, I would like let it get loose enough, and then I just pull it out. I never did the do I never did the door thing, where where you like uh, I never I don't know if that works, where like tie one into your tooth and the other into a door. I never tried it because I could couldn't tie a knot that well. I don't I still don't think I could tie a knot that well. Yeah, if like it got loose enough, I think I'll just knock it out of my tongue or just. I don't think I ever yanked it out. It sometimes can't come out of food, but uh, yeah, yeah, I got, I got to get my money for that. Thank God, thank God that, that those those days are over. Like I kind of wish they weren't, cause like again, I broke a, I broke one tooth. Would love to get it replaced with a a real tooth or let it grow back somehow, like a shark tooth. Shark teeth do do grow back, right? I think. But uh, yeah, I don't think I had to go through all of this. I kinda just had to wait a little bit and then just get rid of it. And then get money. Granted, there probably be some blood sometimes, but uh, it's fine. Anyway. Are we gonna get uh, Kevin to punch him? Oh, hey. I smell something raw. That's the uh. smell of money, Kevin. Mm -hmm. No, that is my mama boiling the fat from Papa's undershirts. I'm offering a hey. tough reward. Daddy, have you seen Jimmy? Oh, Jimmy. I'll help you, Jimmy. Okay, that was actually accident. Like, Take that is ass. Wait, 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 wait. Who the hell is the 50 go to? Because it might be better for you. What is your name? Why, why did I almost call you Timmy? You're not Timmy. Eddie, Eddie, that's your name. You're not Timmy. Wow, I, I just completely forgot his name. But uh, yeah, that's a great. I like how I just keep. I feel like I'm Ida from uh, My Hero Academia, Academia, just with my arms and stuff. Hey. -hee. <laughs> okay, but yes, uh, the the deal is actually good for you. Granted, you're losing. Uh, how, how much? Why am, I, why am I about to sit here and just say how, how much that the tooth fairy? Okay. How much do you get from Tooth Fairy? What does the two? Okay. What the fuck? What, ch what child is this? Well, I'm, okay. Well, me children across the country earn a dollar for every every tooth that they lose. A handful of parents sur surveyed said that their ch their child gets a whopping fifty bucks per tooth from a tooth fairy. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. Who the? How much? 
How many teeth do humans have? They have 32 teeth. To, okay, times 50. About that's about uh, that's about 1,016 uh, bucks. I think 1,600. I think I think I, I could be wrong. I could. I'm probably totally wrong. I did, did as fast as I came ahead. 50 times 32. No, oh, what? Six, 16, 1600. <laughs> okay. 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 Uh, um. Yeah, okay. So, but uh, anyway, 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 anyway. Yeah, um. If anyone got 50 bucks from the Tooth Fairy, uh. Let me know. I want to know. I want to know who the. Who the. Okay, any, any, anyway. Okay, so Eddie, uh, the deal works good for you. Especially if somehow Ed's parents gave him 50 bucks for the thing. You guys be rolling in, in jawbreakers for a long time. But if it's $1, which I, I would expect, $1, $2, something like that, it still works out for you. Because the way they they work, the, these, these idiots here are working on this uh, deal is it, it goes 50 it's 50 to 50 50, but all four of them, Kevin, Ro well, I guess Roth kind of counts. Kevin, Roth, uh, technically it's more between Kevin and Sarah, Jimmy and Roth kind of just here, if you like, but still the four of them to, to the one of you. So you get the, you get the 50 cent and they got to break up the 50 cent between, uh, the rest, all four of these. So much is, much is 50 divided by, um, like I did that math earlier for multiplications about. About 12 point something. Yeah, but about 12.5. Make sure. 50 divided by 4. Yep, 12.5. So they each get... How the fuck? They're going to have to have a half a penny. Or something like that. So yeah, the, the deal works for you. You get 50 cent. That means two draw... Two, two draw breakers. Two jaw breakers versus their... that They each get one if they combine their money. So they have to at least share the... Share the jawbreaker or cut it in half. So I've seen your jawbreakers. They're gigantic. You can cut that in half. Probably fine. Probably, probably annoying, but still. But uh, yeah. Now if it's because um yeah, I don't know how to break up this fifty because there's four. There are four of you. I mean, there's five of you. Why am I? Why did my brain keep rejecting the idea that either Rolf or Jimmy are not part of the deal? But yes, uh. Take the take the deal, Eddie. There is a loophole. I can help you. Almost half. I will give take you money. Take it, it. Take it. Take it. Okay, okay. Get off my back. <laughs> it still works out for you. There's a loophole. Okay. Oh. oh. Ed, you really must try to eat softer um food. Yes, yeah. Like butter, Ed boy. Butter. Plain butter. Yes. Listen to me, stop Mary, just butter. Boy. I haven't. When churned by Rolf, it is better than you. Okay. I am sleeping. <laughs> oh dear, Rolf, what are you doing? Getting the you two out. The Who's out? With a what? Yes. <laughs> now you do it at home. Boy, we don't worry, WD. We talk to everybody. In it. Rolf's so confused. Sure. Come on, Come on WD. You're smart at this. Huh? Been defeat. Did you huh. get it? Where's the tooth? Tooth, tooth, tooth. Rolf cannot hear one peep. <laughs> My tooth hurts. Yeah, I wonder why. I never had plunges. Ah. So how's this get it out? Ed, isn't that uncomfortable for your tooth? No way, Double D. Sarah says nothing soothes pain like a nylon rope. Anything for you, gullible uh, big brother. I, I guess. I don't really know how. Patience in extracting Ed's tooth is really unnecessary. Uh. This is a virtue. Okay. Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. Think, I'm not going. Kevin. But they're toast. That's either Kevin or Ralph. Probably Kevin. Are the kangaroos going to get it? That was a good. That was a good. And Moby Dork is ah, mine. Hope the kangaroo. On earth did you enlist Kevin as an associate to your scam? Yeah, that that is a lot of work to to get Kevin to do shit with you. Now she, I, I bet you the kangaroos are gonna get it. Get your stubborn like an ingrown back hair. 
I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> so what we're seeing is that Ed is stronger than these two combined. Really? I feel like you said it before. Soon we will have that tooth in the What's so funny? That's your tooth. Ah! Yay! Uh, so what? Since it's my tooth, I, can I get to keep all the money. Yeah, the, the deal deal's off, Captain Ahab. Yeah, deal's only for uh howling like a dork. I'm out of here. Bye. Kevin, let me resort your shoes. You do what? see the irony, don't you? Uh the one where we forget about Ed's tooth and cash in mine? Yeah. Here's the overview, Eddie. Mm -hmm. The tooth fairy only appears at night when mm -hmm. you're asleep, and the candy store closes in half an hour. <laughs> so, if it's sleeping she wants, it's sleeping she gets. At night, though. Is there a doctor in the house? No. The so, we go. For immediate loading and unloading of passengers only. I don't see her. Why the fuck do we have airplane playing right now? Because you can't see her, right, Double D? Sure. Very well put, Ed. Huh, no more sore tooth. Yay. So two Real teeth. Smooth, Ed. My tooth stuck on the roof. And so's his. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't eat it. Don't oh eat it. My. <laughs> You're an animal, Ed. He really is. Trucking. Cough up the teeth, big head. Uh, yeah, please. Don't... One moment, sir. Please, head, don't talk with your mouth full. Especially with all. The... Yeah. Sorry, I thought about what was actually. I'm stuck. Eat the tooth. Like your head. No teeth means no cash. And no cash means no jawbreakers. So we do all work for nothing. I look like a hockey player. <laughs> so we're going to play hockey, is what you're saying. Send their shots. Today. You're a bug. <laughs> He's a pinhead. <laughs> Cheer up, Ed. <laughs> okay. That, okay, I'll be honest. That was, like, that was a... We did all that work for double double of nothing. We did all the work. Got got a profit. Got our, mo got our own money back. So we'd have $2 or somebody got 100 bucks. But, um... Yeah, uh... Be, at least jawbreaker is 20 25 so about four dollars so that would about we would have we would have 400 jawbreakers if he asked him fuck up if you guys got got the 50 bucks per tooth if not we have just have four still we still would have won we could have each had one and then we could have split the other one in third unless no one got also i'm glad the kangaroos didn't get the tooth I mean, I, I would have been okay with maybe Jimmy getting a tooth. I don't think Jimmy cared at all. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know what Double D's point was. Yeah, yeah, the tooth fairy comes at night, but it, was the world going to end in the night? So, what's he trying to tell us? That the, that's the thing he's trying to tell us that the world is going to end the next morning. So, because that's how that's that's the way to take it. Well, at least I'm taking it because. Yeah, so what, so what if the Tooth Fairy comes at night and the candy store closes? We can just wait for the next day, you know? Unless the next day, unless it's going out of business, the world's ending, or they're just not open the next day. It's like a Sunday thing with Chick-fil-A. But we can just wait till the next, and they're open again. Duh. Again, unless the world ends or the shop goes out of business, so. Uh, but if it's going out of business, we could have had so. We actually could probably got, got more for the one tooth. We just trade the we just trade the the owner a tooth for a jawbreaker. <laughs> That'd be a weird deal, I feel like. So, yeah, double D, you had a point, but it may, it, it was no reason to say it at all because we just have to wait. Okay, but oh well. Also, he has a blue tongue. I actually, why did I forget that? But yeah, all the plans were terrible because uh, we. We could have, uh, mm, mm. yeah, no, I'm not gonna. Uh, we, we might want a tooth, but I'm not gonna have uh, Ed go through another, uh, what's that, cracker nut? A coconut to do this. 
Why does Double D have something mask? I guess he's ready for 2020, even though. How old is he? I don't, know, I, don't, I don't care. Yeah, Eddie, you could that for this plane, you could literally left the. Uh, you could could literally just held a sign saying I painted it, and Ed still would st still would have gone for it. He wouldn't have got anything, and Double D would definitely still been violated. But oh well. Lisa the king and get the yeah see some ants. Yeah. Wait. Okay, sorry that one that uh. Sorry. Okay, these these are all ants except for that one. That one's an uncle. So anyway, uh, uh, so yeah. Again, the deal was go was good on Eddie's part because he still would got more money than everybody else. So, but yeah, I get you greedy. You want to get all the money. So, eh. but yeah, everybody's plans failed. Though I don't really know how this one was supposed to help. Yeah, I don't get that one at all. I guess we're going to suck the tooth out of him, I guess. I don't know. But, I don't know. Uh, then, uh, cat, uh, I don't, I don't, I could be wrong, but, um, I, don't, I think a nylon rope tied around tooth would not be that comfortable, I guess. But, I don't know. I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not a dentist or a doctor. Or I don't have baby teeth anymore because I'm not, not that young anymore. I wish. I like this face. He looks so upset. He's so mad about this uh, butter toast trying to escape from him. That's gonna be dirt. I'm gonna say it's gonna be dirty. What, what? We just saw him eat from a gutter, so he 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 don't care. He he did also eat a uh, Eddie. Also, Sarah gave a quit quick while uh, Kevin and J uh, Kevin uh, Rolf. I'm gonna call him Jimmy. Kevin and Rolf. They're Jimmy characters. Kevin Roth did not give up, so get on them. They kind of got fired. And, uh, they, they almost had it. But they more just got, got... Eddie has a big tooth. I like how it looks like his... Ha it looks like a tooth, but it also looks like his... It has eyes, like their, their two eyes, mouth, and then the mole. Or, or it's his mouth, and this is just a mustache? He yeah, the French tooth. Oh, no. Much of my mustache looks like this. Because it's more grown on one side. Well, uh, okay. Weird analogy, but oh well. But at least we got two, and we got. And Rob's gonna go tie his laces or something? We're gonna go tie Kevin's lace? I don't know. Maybe we can't. Maybe we can't get Naz. That, that was something. Tooth. Hey, Tooth Fairy here. Tooth. Sweet. Sweet, juicy tooth here. Let land. What the hell does that one say? Oh well. But also we had the airplane, airplane going on right there. When did the airplane come out? Let's find out. Well, huh? I spelled airplane and it still got it for me. Airplane, airplane came out as a 19, 1980. Okay, comedy. Yeah, if you never seen airplane the movie, go go watch it. I highly recommend it. So yeah, they <laughs> unless they're just no, unless they were just mentioning just any any airplane uh place. But yeah, I'm pretty sure um um double did double D not mention about going and I could go back and watch my okay. Oh two that the two fairy only comes at night. So why are we doing this? It is broad daylight, and then it it just eats all of that. And then the tooth. I guess he has the teeth strong enough to eat real teeth. Is that Fu Futurama thing? I don't know. I've actually never seen Futurama. So if that is from them, I know. I heard about it somewhere. The only teeth strong enough to eat real teeth. I don't know where they came from. I know. That, I know that one Teen Titans Go thing where they had the uh, tooth fairy there that could eat teeth, and I think Raven could as well. So eh, but apparently uh, Ed could do do it as well. I don't. I don't want to ask what that stuff tastes like, because that'd be disgusting. But um, yeah, I'm more more along with along with Double D. Just even thinking about it, darn me. But I think this all started because of coconut. Technically, it all started because Johnny is. I was gonna say poor, but he just had coconut. Why do you have coconut? Why do you have exactly three? Um, 
Okay. Oh, I, I I have to assume that uh, Plank had a coconut as well. But uh, Eddie should. Oh. I was gonna say Eddie should learn, and not uh, scam Johnny, but he don't learn at all. Okay, so I take back everything I was gonna say. Uh, so yeah. So poor, 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 poor. We never, we never ate the coconut either. Got coconut milk, which I'm happy for. The fuck is he drinking? What the? What the? Is that a cup or that's an actual shoe? I'm going to hope for the latter. That that is a cup. Now, apparently he can. I have to assume that he can normally eat a brick, if if uh, he didn't have sore tooth. So. Hmm. Hey, how about you guys tell me your craziest, uh, if you remember, like, your baby tooth story, like, when you try to pull it out or you try to help somebody pull it out. I, I won't read them all. I, I won't, I won't, I want your teeth. <laughs> I want your teeth stories. I'm the tooth story fairy person. I'll give you a like, for, like, and trade for a, a tooth story. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'm running out of things to say, so, bye.